Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, this follows what we have a raised to power m minus n. This same thing as a raised to power m over a raised to power n. At this here, this becomes 8 raised to power x over 8 squared equals to 80 from here. Then this same thing as 8 raised to power x over 8 square 8 times 8, that's 64. They equals to, you can write this as 80 over 1. Then next step here, we cross multiply 8 raised to power x times 1, same thing as 8 raised to power x, then equals to 80 times 64 here. The next step, we take the log on both sides. Here we have log 8 raised to power x equals to log 80 times 64 on this side. That is, this follows the power of log n. When we have log m raised to power p, this same thing as p log m. Then here, what we have becomes x log 8 equals to log 80 times 64. Then from here, we divide both sides by log 8. That is, divide this side by log 8. Also, divide this side by log 8, which implies that log 8 cancel each other. We have x equals to log. 80 times 64 over log 8. Then, here yeah, this follows the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, this same thing as log a plus log b. That is, what we have becomes x equals to log. 80 plus log 64 over log 8. Then, next step here, we separate this into two fractions. That is, we have x equals to log 80 over log 8 plus log. 64 over log 8. And here, 64 can be expressed as 8 times 8, that's 8 squared. And this can write as x equals to log 80 over log 8 plus log 8 squared over log 8. Then here we apply the power of logarithm. 2 comes there. As this we have x equals to log 80 over log 8 plus 2 log 8 over log 8. Then here log 8 cancelled each other. We have 2 left, which implies x equals to log 80 over log 8 plus 2. Then also, we can write 80 as 8 times 10. That is, what we have here becomes x equals to log 8 times 10 over log 8 plus 2. That is here. This follows the law of logarithm as well. I can write that x equals to log 8 plus log 10 over log 8 plus 2. Then here, we separate this into two fractions. And we have x equals to log 8 over log 8 plus log 10 
over log 8 plus 2 here. That is, here we have log 8 cancel each other and 1 left here. That is, x equals to 1 plus 2, that's 3, and plus log 10 over log 8. Then also here, yeah, 10 can be written as 2 times 5, which implies we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 times 5 over log 8. That is, this also follows the law of log theorem, and we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 plus log 5 over log 8 then here we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 over log 8 plus log 5 over log 8 then here also we can express it as 2 times 2 times 2 that's 2 cube then what we have here becomes x equals to 3 plus log 2 over log 2 cube plus log 5 over log 2 cube. Then here yeah, we apply the power of log ring. 3 comes here. And also here, and we have x equals to 3 plus log 2 over 3 log 2 plus log 5 over 3 log 2. And this here, we have log 2 cancelled each other. All that becomes x equals to 3 plus 1 over 3 plus also 1 over 3 log 5 over log 2. Then, here we can express 3 plus 1 over 3 as 10 over 3. So, x equals to 10 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 over log 2. Also here, we apply change of this. When we have log a, over log b. This is same thing as log a to base b. At this here we have x equals to 10 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 5 base 2. Then we bring to this together as one fraction. We have x equals to the SM here that's 3. That this here we have 10 plus log 5 base 2. Then the value of x here we have 10 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Then let's check here. If this satisfies this given problem, that is, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 10 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3 that is what we have here becomes 8 raised to power 10 plus log 5 base 2 over 3 then minus 2 here is it equals to 80 on this side then here we bring this power together as one this 2 over 1 and we have 8 raised to power the SCM of here as 3 but this here we have 10 plus log 5 base 2 and minus 6 here now. Is it equals to 80 on this side? Then here, 10 minus 6, that's 4. We have 8 raised to the power 4 plus log 5 base 2 over 3. Is it equals to 80 on this side? Then here, we can express it as 2 raised to power 3, which is raised to power 4 plus log 5 base 2 over 3. 
is it equals to 80 from here then here yeah, this power multiplies and 3 here cancel each other we have 2 raised to power 4 plus log 5 base 2 is it equals to 80 on this side then we can separate this on the law of indices and this becomes 2 raised to power 4 times 2 raised to power log 5 base 2 is it equals to 80 from here 2 raised to power 4 2 multiply itself 4 times that's 16 then times this follows and we have a raised to power log b to base a which is equals to b is same thing as 5 is it equals to 80 from here and of course 16 times 5 give us 80 which is equals to 80 on this side left hand side equals to the right hand side and therefore we conclude here that x equals to 10 plus log 5 is 2 all over 3. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget to step, subscribe for more videos. And turn the notification bell on. Share this video with thumbs up and put your comment. See you next class and bye for now.